Hello guys welcome to my new video. So today I'm gonna share my setting how I play Fortnite smoothly in my 17 uh, a 2GB graphics card. So um, uh, first I'm gonna share my PC configuration. I'm using 16, 16GB RAM and Ryzen 5 3600 and my GPU is uh, 17 uh, 2GB DDR5. So as you can see I'm using 1280x720p as my resolution because it's only a 2GB graphics card it cannot handle 1080p gaming so after that vSync is obviously off and you should li uh, limit your frame at 60fps because you cannot get more than 60fps in this graphics card after that rendering mode is obviously a lower graphics setting I mean power performance based setting then as you can see i'm using 70 percent as my 3d resolution because under that you cannot see a single thing it's uh, only just pixelated uh, thing and if, uh, if you use more than 70 you will get frame drop that's it so that's why i prefer 70 percent then everything is as low as possible uh, as the distance is near the texture is low everything is as low as possible uh if you use this setting i think you will get a smooth gameplay as i do every day and last one thing I want to add up, uh, try to avoid close fight uh, because when I'm taking close call fight, uh, I, I take uh, some lag. I cannot see it in film drops, but in real life you will see some uh, lag or something. Uh, it, you, it's not smooth when you are in close fight. So try to avoid that. You can also use MSI Afterburner to get a stable FPS. First you have to open MSI Afterburner then you will get a uh, uh, icon over here. It's called Reverse Turner. Sorry, Reverse Turner. Uh, if you don't find that, go over here and uh, you will also find it over here. Reverse Turner. So after opening that, uh, you will see application detection level. Set it to high and here you can see frame limit and set it around uh, 6, 60 FPS. But if your PC can handle 60 FPS, you can also try 31 FPS. Don't use 30 FPS because 31 and 30 FPS has a huge difference. So 31 will be better. Now let me show you a benchmark with this setting. As you can see, I'm getting around 60 FPS and the frame, frame time is uh, very stable. Uh, there is no big difference. So if you use this setting, I hope you will get a much better experience. And as I'm using it regularly, I don't get any problem. It's, uh, it's quite good very smooth so I, I i highly recommend you to use this setting and if you have any problem if you want to know anything just comment down below i'll try my best to help you and thanks for watching if you like this video then please subscribe share see you another time goodbye every day i want your touch and every way i can't get it up any day just to feel the rush this just ain't enough Oh, 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 oh,